Closer to home in New Sense 6, there is a new test available in the tri-states tonight that tells doctors whether a patient has already had COVID-19. It's called a serology test and Quincy Medical Group already using this as another tool to try and stop the spread of the virus. WGEM's Kara Biernat reports. Doctors at Quincy Medical Group have a new test in their lab tonight. It's called a serology test. Generally, this is a test that if somebody wants to know if those symptoms they had a month or two ago when they couldn't be tested, was that really possibly COVID-19? QMG doctors say it allows them to test antibodies to the coronavirus through a blood test, meaning they can tell if a patient has had the virus and recovered. Chief Medical Officer Richard Schlepphorst says this test doesn't give them all the answers they're looking for when it comes to long-term immunity, but it's a start. And generally, we kind of think that when antibodies show up, that's kind of helpful to know that you're likely immune. We just don't have data on that for this particular infection yet. It's too new. Physician of Family Practice Rick Noble says the data from this test helps track exposure in the community in an effort to eventually see who's still vulnerable and who may not be. It will help um, civic leaders, health uh, department leaders, to help in that complex question of how do we reopen the economy? How do we reopen uh, businesses that uh, we've had to shut down? Doctors say they have about 360 tests available right now. They say although the test does not show if you currently have the virus, it does show antibodies after two weeks in most patients. So if you definitely had some symptoms that in the back of your mind were thinking that, hey, maybe back in January, maybe back in February, I even had some people say, you know, back in October, I felt this way. Um, I think it would be a good idea to contact your doctor at home and uh, and then inquire about receiving this uh, this antibody test. And doctors say that if you are looking to get this test to call your primary physician, they'll ask you some questions and they'll have to order the test for you depending on your past symptoms. Doctors say the test costs around 50 bucks and is billable through insurance. They say it takes one or two days to get results back.